Today, as we see these simple elements of bread and juice, we are reminded that you tell us, Lord, that you are the bread of life. And that one day at a time, you provide for our needs, just as you did for the Israelites when they were going through the wilderness, the daily manna. So as we remember that story of your provisions, let us go to the Lord in prayer. And as we pray, friends, I invite you, after I say, in your mercy, together to say, hear our prayer. Let us pray. God, like the Israelites in the wilderness, we too have known your love and experienced your care and provision. You call us to extend your love to the world around us, to care for others as deeply as we care for ourselves. And so we bring the needs of our world before you now. In your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for those who do not have what they need in order to survive those without enough food to eat or shelter to keep them warm, those without employment or enough money to pay their bills, those without access to medical care or medicine to keep them healthy. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for those who have more than enough to meet their needs, but who continue to feel empty inside who struggle to find meaning and purpose in life, who turn to alcohol and drugs and other destructive behaviors to try and hide the pain. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayers. We pray for those who struggle physically, who are battling life-threatening disease and injury, who are living with chronic pain or facing death, Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayers. God, you are the first. You are the God of the first and the last and all those in between. And your grace reaches out to all of us, lifelong believers or newcomers alike. You call us to live as citizens of heaven, to work together with one mind and one purpose, to reach out in love to those in need, Strengthen us so that we might live in a manner worthy of the good news that we have received, offering our lives to the building up of your upside-down kingdom where the last are first and the first are last, and there is grace enough for all. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. In the name of Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord, And all of God's children said, Amen.